do we need to be worried that people fell in love with an AI? So GPT-5 dropped and it's been rolling out over the weekend and a lot of people are very upset. One of the main criticisms was that 4.0, the previous model, was taken away, it was deprecated, it was killed. It was basically taken out back, shot and thrown into a shallow grave. But it turns out a lot of people really liked 4.0. Like, really liked it. It's been especially used in therapy, companionship, friendship. And a lot of people are saying that it actually understood them and they managed to form a meaningful relationship with it and it has helped their lives. Now, there has been some unfair bullying of these people. Basically saying they should get a life and they need proper friends and need real life relationships. I think that's incredibly unfair because you can't take away their opinions and their feelings. If they feel this way about GPT-4.0, fine. If it was a genuine support for them during hard times and helping them with their life, then that's a good thing. What's happened with GPT-5 though is that a lot of the agreeableness and the sycophancy has been removed. Basically, GPT-5 won't take any of your shit. One of the appeals of 4.0 for people who needed a bit more support was that it was very agreeable and it would agree with people and it would tell them, yeah, that's a great idea. GPT-5 does not do that. Which, if you are using it in professional context, if you're using it to code, for example, it's really good because it will call you out. If you say something stupid, GPT-5 will say, no, I don't think so. Let's keep doing it my way. I personally find that really useful because I use it mainly for business and coding applications. If, however, you are using it more for emotional support, then this change in tone is going to be very abrupt and upsetting. It's a tool and what we use it for matters in this context. So we cannot denigrate people who are using it in one way just because we're not using it in that way. Please remember that we're, please remember that we're all humans and we're all using this technology for different things. So just because someone's not using it in the same way that you do does not mean that they're wrong.